guys, I'm going to go one, two, three, four, showing you how to get a uh, muzzle flash effect for Windows Movie Maker using only Paint and Google and plus Windows Movie Maker, of course. So, the first thing you'll need is a clip of the gun movement. You just drag it to your bar. And I've just got a picture of my hand, a video of my hand, sorry, pretending to be a gun. Then you want to find the frame where the gun movement jerks. So, it's about there. Then you want to click this button here which says split frame. So click that and that splits it into two different videos. This is useful further on. Now uh, don't do anything with that because what you want to do is go to tools. Uh, go down to here it says take picture from preview and you want to click that. And then save it somewhere where you know you're going to find it. So just save it in mine. And then that's saved. That will pop up on your um, imports of media, but don't bother with that. And now you want to open Paint. Once you've opened Paint, you want to go to Google and uh, get an image of a muzzle flash. So here I've typed in muzzle flash on Google Images. I'm just going to search that. And um, you get all these images. Don't worry about the background, by the way. So I'm just going to use this one because it looks pretty cool. What you want to do then is copy that image. And then you'll no longer need Google, so you can just close that down. Now, in Paint, you want to paste the image. So you go to Edit, go down to Paste, and hit Paste. Then you want to do this quite carefully. There's this little tool up here, which looks like that. And you click that, and you have to draw around the shape of that but I'm I'm um I'm gonna turn the camera off for a minute and just come back to you once I've done that because if you don't do it carefully it'll look a bit rubbish. Right I've cut that out now so I can just move that like that. Now with this little image here what you've cut out you wanna hit edit and then copy and then you get you open a different document of paint which I'm gonna do now and then you want to get the image of your screenshot that you got in Movie Maker. So you just open <coughs> some desktop. Okay, so there. And then you open that. So now that's there. Now what you have to do is go up here and when, and because you've copied the previous image of the muzzle flash hit paste and that will pop up there now it has a white background at the moment so what I want to do is hit this button here which changes it to the background what you've already got on your uh, picture so like that and then you just move it into position and fiddle around with it until it's perfect but I'm not I'm just gonna do it quickly and then go up here, hit save as, and then just rename it as a pick of muzzle, muzzle flash. Right, saved. And then you uh, open Move Maker again. Right, once you're in Move Maker, you want to go up to File. Uh, not file, yeah. No, you don't want to go up to file. You want to go to import and click photos, pictures, uh, and then uh, wait, and then get your picture up of um, your muzzle flash and your gun, and then hit import. And then once that's there, you click it, go up to tools options and make it um, make the duration as low as it can go so 0.125 on Vista and then hit OK and drag that picture in between your two uh, different pictures because you split it earlier let go uh, add a sound effect in whatever and then this is what it looks like
lush. You only need to use paint and Google. So that's how to make a muzzle flush effect on Windows Movie Maker using paint and Google.